top 12 most expensive photographs ever sold. Have you ever wondered what the most expensive photographs ever sold were? How about how much it brought at auction? Most photographers that have ever sold a picture or even thought about selling a photo have pondered while photos from all different disciplines of photography have sold successfully. If we're talking about the most expensive photo ever sold, we're going to be talking about fine art photography. Fine art photography can be a strange and volatile market that can rapidly change. While most photos sell for what people would consider reasonable amounts, some inflate to numbers most photographers can only ever see in their dreams. The value and final selling price of artistic photograph prints are generally not set by the artists themselves, but by the people who buy the photos. Most of these kinds of prints are sold at auction, which is the case for 9 of 10 photos on this list. As photographers, it is important for us to remember that these prices are extraordinary and are not based on the artist's abilities alone. Otherwise, it would be easy to be discouraged by seeing this type of success in such difficult market. 1. Lake Phantom Peter Lake took this image in the area known as Antelope Canyon in Arizona, USA. The black and white image sold in 2014 for a whopping $6,005,000. Its place as the most expensive photograph ever sold is debated because the buyer was private and anonymous, meaning the sale did not be verified. 2. Andreas Gorski Rain II $4,338,500. This image of the Lower Rhine River was taken by Andreas Korski. In this image, the river Rhine flows across the print with green fields showing on either side. The sky is overcast which adds a dull and gray tone of the photo. It was the second of a set of six taken by Korski depicting the Rhine. It is a chromogenic color print that sold for $4,338,500 in 2011. 3. Richard Prince Spiritual America $3,973,000 This image also comes with its fair share of controversy. The image is of a naked 10-year-old child posing a bathtub. The child is an American actress and a model. Brooke Schultz, the nudity of the child in a photograph was not accepted well by some of the art world members. And photo was finally removed from the exhibition at the Take Modern after a stern warning from the police. 4. Cindy Sherman, Untitled 96, $3,890,500. Untitled 96 is a self-portrait featuring a young Cindy Sherman dressed in retro-style clothing. She's lying on the floor and her gaze is fixed off-camera. The orange hue of the photo from the dark and light orange colors of her clothing gives the photo a certain overtone. 5. Gilbert and George to Her Majesty $3,765,276 this work by British artist Gilbert Porsche and George Passmore, known collectively as Gilbert and George, is a gelatin silver print that was sold in London for $3,765,276 in 2008. 6. Jeff Wall Dead Troops Talk $3,666,500 Officially titled Dead Fruits Talk, a version after an ambush of the Red Army Path Road near Mokor, Afghanistan, winter 1986. This image was a stage and digitally stitched work by Jeff Wall in 1982. The models were shot in the studio and then digitally placed onto the outdoor landscape. 7. Andreas Korski, 99 cent a second. Depeshawn, $3,346,456. Andreas Gorski's 99 cent a second Depeshawn is a chromogenic color print that was styled as a Depeche. The picture is a very large, spanning over 11 feet wide and nearly 6 feet tall. The scene is that of a 99 cent store in Los Angeles. Gorski uses the semi-symmetrical line and colorful packaging on the shelves to create a high contrast image that will catch anyone's eye. 8. Andreas Gorski, Chicago, Board of Trade II. $3,298,755 He 
Here we have another chromogenic color print by Andrzej Skorupski, Chicago Board of Trade. Gorski captured this image at the Board of Trade in Chicago, Illinois, the United States, in 1999. The picture was taken from above, looking down into the pit and shows brokers moving quickly while wearing their bright color jackets. Gorski used digital editing to layer multiple exposures of the image to create the blurred look of the movement you can see around the brokers. 9. Richard Prince entitled Cowboy, $3,077,000. This photo is actually a photo of a photo, Dean 3 photography, by its artist Richard Prince. The style eventually helped the shape and art from of its own, generally referred to as photography of photography. This particular scene depicts the Marlboro Man and was taken of an ad in Time magazine. Prince was sued by the original photographer for using a copyrighted image, but the judge ruled in Prince's favor. The picture was an ectocolor print, and it sold at Saltimize, New York in 2014 for $3,077. 10. Cindy Sherman, untitled film, still $48, $2,965,000. Untitled film Steel 48 by Cindy Sherman depicts a woman standing at the side of a road in a curb with a suitcase sitting beside her. The girl is facing away from the camera and is dressed in a plaid skirt and sneakers, which gives a particular schoolgirl type of innocence. This black and white image has deep contrast and an overall dark. Some do them, leaving viewers with many questions. The picture is a chromogenic color print. This photo sold for $2,965,000 in May of 2015. 11. Peter Lake Illusion in the same sale as Phantom in November 2013, the same private buyer also acquired Peter Lick's masterwork illusion for the princely sum of $2,400,000, securing the Melbourne-born photographer a second ranking among the most expensive photographs in the history. The private sale also included Lick's image Eternal Moods, which sold for $1,100,000 thousand dollars, putting the overall sale at the ten million dollars mark. 12. Andreas Korski, Chicago Board of Trade Another photograph from Andreas Korski's iconic stock exchange series, Chicago Board of Trade, fetched a massive two million three hundred fifty five thousand five hundred ninety seven dollars at this sale at Selzabai's London in 2013. Described by Sosobias as a monument of the Goliath of global trade and the seat of contemporary economic power. From afar, the cacophony of the activity in the image is indiscernible, while closer inspection reveals a monetary glimpse into the daily business of Chicago's traders.